Today we've got the GamerStorm Castle 240EX and we're going to be installing it in a gaming PC featuring a MacCube 310, also by GamerStorm. Because we want to put this radiator at the front of the case, we want to put the fans pulling air into the case. So we would put it like so. And then you just need to get the radiator screws, which are the long ones, and screw them through like so. Now that we have the fans installed to the radiator, we want to take off the front panel of the case so that we can put the radiator into the front and screw it in with the smaller radiator screws. So because this build is a Ryzen AM4 build, we want to use the stock AMD backplate but we've removed it because we need to use different screws on it. These screws, which come with the cooler. So you basically just want to install all four on the front of the motherboard, like so. Next, we want to take uh, these brackets here with these four flat-headed screws, and we want to install them onto our water block. So take uh, make sure that you don't touch the thermal paste on the bottom of the water block that's pre-applied. And just place it so that the chamfered edges face upwards and then these screws can be countersunk in. And you have to do this for all four screws. So now that we have both brackets installed, one on the water block and one on the back plate, we can turn the water block like so, so that the hoses face the ram. And we just insert the four screws. So now that the radiator is successfully mounted, we just have to acknowledge the cables that come with it and we have to plug them in correctly. 